It's my firm belief that as students on this campus, we all have one or two organizations which are central to our identity. For many of you, that organization might be a fraternity, or a sorority, or a sports team. For me, that very organization is Student Senate. Over the past three years, I've had the opportunity to serve in Student Senate in a variety of positions. First as first year senator, then as student concerns chair, and now by representing the Cox School of Business. My name is Jay Wood, and I'm running for vice president because I believe I have the experience, passion, and innovative ideas to help lead this campus into the next century. As vice president, my platform will consist of three main topics, community, transparency, and responsibility. I envision an SMU where all students, male or female, Greek or non-Greek, athlete or non-athlete, undergrad or grad, can all put their differences aside and focus on our shared experience of being a Mustang. As such, I believe Student Senate can play an integral role in reinforcing this from the institutional level. For example, let us analyze the ways we fund organizations to incentivize those organizations which historically haven't collaborated to co collaborate and cooperate in the future. For example, if a Greek organization pairs up with a graduate student organization, let us provide them extra funds for that event so we can incentivize them for continue forging these bonds in the future. The second item on my platform is transparency. Students often voice their concerns that the proceedings of Senate are not as transparent as they could be. Although weekly minutes are posted online, these minutes do not capture everything that is said or done within the chamber. Given this, I feel that a few targeted refinements can pay immeasurable dividends. For example, let us live stream our weekly Senate meetings so that all of those across campus who want to be knowledgeable about our proceedings can be so. Moreover, I believe it's important that each of the individual Senate committees post weekly minutes of their meetings online. So, for example, if an organization's funding request is rejected, that organization can figure out who spoke up against them and, more importantly, what their rationale was. The third objective of my vice presidency will be to take responsibility for the various changes which we seek to implement on this campus. Oftentimes, Senate passes a plethora of bills, very, very few of which are actually enacted. In my very first day in office as vice president, I plan to propose a bill which will establish an implementation committee. This committee will be charged with strategizing and organizing students to implement the various resolutions of Senate. Among the membership of this committee will be the student body vice president and an ex officio position for the student representative to the board of trustees. Only by re leveraging all of our resources can we actually implement the changes which we seek. Over the past 100 years, our influence as students has gradually, yet steadily, decreased. I plan to fix that. On April 3rd and 4th, I need your support. Don't forget to log on to smu.edu slash elections and win with me. Oh yeah.